It's another day in Columbus, Ohio, heading over to do some 3D work. And later today, I'm going to head down to a trailer park uh, to see if we can park our camper there. It's got to be livable for my wife and kids. No muggers. No muggers allowed, so stay out. I'm here at Mosey's Pizza, about to get some lunch. We're trying to move our camper down here to Columbus. So... At some point today, I'm supposed to go down to some guy's trailer park, and uh, he's going to let us park our camper there. So then we'll be closer and won't have to drive like almost two hours whenever I come down here. I've been like staying down here for days, but you know that, I think. I finished up work for the day. I'm heading over to Casablanca Acting and Modeling Agency. Or I have an appointment with them, so we're going to see how it goes. I'll let you know. Probably. I might. We're out here at the field. And I got my drone I built. Uh, Victor's got it. We're going to fly it. I'm going to fly it. I'm going to learn how to fly it. So, see how successful this is. My first time flying a real drone. I've flown like a little bitty one. But this is a real one. The big, well, it's the one I built. It's got to be real. So my drone went out of control when I was flying it. Totally wasn't my fault. It just kept going backwards and then it hit the ground and tumbled. Sorry you didn't see it. Victor wasn't doing his job videotaping it with my phone. He's trying it out to see what the problem is. I don't know. It just did something weird. Back at the office. We didn't get to fly very long. Ran out of battery life. Anyway, we're going to play some virtual reality here. We're going to play a game called Climby. Don't know what it is, but we'll find out in a second. Mike's in Google Earth. I think he's in space hovering above the Earth. I'm not 100% sure. But it looks like a long way down. He's, he's geeking out. Speechless. Victor, the man, awesome. just stepped into the room. The Earth right here. Give me a high five, Victor. It's close. Try again. Victor over here oh, right on. You need the recurve, recur, mate. <laughs> Victor's gonna wish he would have stayed around for this. <laughs> okay. I think it's better if I if I reach out right to the edge. <laughs> alright, alright, I'm up. I'm up. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I try not to scream that time. Really <laughs> oh man. Oh, all right. Yeah, it's on your phone here. Alright. Oh. All right, we're back with Tim and Climby. I lost my hand. Uh oh, did the battery? Dead? You might have to try to do this. You might have lost a hand. Now you got to try to survive with one hand. hand. I don't know if that's going to work or not. You might I'm just have to shake. jump. You might just have to jump for real. Oh my word! All right, here we go. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> no! I think you're done, man. Yeah. I think if the I got some exciting news. Gonna want to see this. What is that? Well, let me tell you. It's uh. Let me take a look here first, so, so I can tell you what I'm looking at. It's my remote pilot certificate. I'm officially a legit drone pilot. Official. Yep. I passed my test. Just got out. Two-hour test. I did it in less than an hour. And uh, you got to pass with 70%, and I got 78%. So that's pretty good. Near the end there, I was, I was getting a little scared because I knew I was getting a couple of them wrong. Uh, but I got most of them right. Back at the office. I don't know what's going on, but they pulled this big boy out. It's huge. It actually goes in that box right there. It's a big drum. I think it's the biggest one they got. Smashing. I'm in a place called Skyline. Uh, they're known for their chili checking it out I've never been here before uh, and then to be heading over to Rob's to start some 3d work this is lunch it's spaghetti noodles with chili stacked on top and uh, shredded cheese pretty good so being my first time here they give me a goodie bag it's got all kinds of stuff in here got some hot sauce got some crackers like those crackers in that bowl and uh, I haven't really looked oh Got a York Mint and uh, some stickers or something like that. I'll figure it out later. Always told by the employees that Skyline, where I just ate, uh, known for their chili, 
is actually a tourist attraction in the state of Ohio. They've got about 144 stores across the nation, uh, but they're actually really good, and in a few years they're going to be introducing like three more types of chili. So it's like chili dogs and uh, ch chili on top of uh, spaghetti noodles and other, a few other things. Really good stuff though, really good. Check them out, recommend you check them out. I'm just about to leave work here, and I look up into the sky, and what do I see? You see that? That's a star. It's so bright. That's the brightest I've ever seen a star. That's crazy. I'm home with the wife and kids, and we're having stuffed French toast and coffee. Not a big fan of the coffee pot, but this pot is good. Lawrence is begging for food. Mom is making food. Oh, man. We're here in the cold. Uh, my wife broke the truck down. Actually, it broke down when she was driving it, but the belt came off. I'm getting it towed up to the dealership about 10 miles north of here. Hopefully, they can get it fixed. We'll see. I'm in the room. I'm in the waiting room. They told me the water pump went out. The water pump went out. So hopefully they can get that fixed tonight. If not, I think we have an emergency vehicle we can use. But we see. We see. A few things I wanted to update you guys on. Because I said it would. I, um, somewhat. First off, the warranty on the truck was good. So the truck got covered. We paid a $100 deductible. Which actually was not bad because it was going to be like $600 without the warranty. And second of all, going to the agency, they liked me a lot. I sat down, had a one-on-one -on -one with, uh, with the owner. She likes me a lot, so I think I'm going to go there. But I still got to get my portfolio together to, to make that all work. Anyway, subscribe to my channel, like my videos, tell your friends, vacuum your carpet because it's probably dirty. Needs vacuuming, definitely.